TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida, 9 a.m. Eastern Time on Monday morning, 30 minutes to go until the opening bell. And we got markets starting off on the downside right now. Dow futures off 107 points, trading at 27,524. Got S&P futures negative by 12, trading at 3,078. NASDAQ futures negative by 31, trading at 82.25. All the indices, indices off about four-tenths percent. You got oil trading lower off 72 cents at 56.52. Got the gold contract jumping around a bit. Gold right now off a buck 50 at 14.61. And the bond market closed today for veterans. Happy Veterans Day out there to all those that served or have served or are serving. Jumping over to the markets, we'll start things off with the indices. We'll start it off with the Dow. A little bit of volatility this morning. We have some Hong Kong unrest. The indice over there down about 3%. Currently, the Dow trading 27,520, just off the lows we made in about that last half hour. NASDAQ 100 accelerates lower to about 4 a.m. from 82.32 down to a low of 82.14, up about 10 points from that level with the NASDAQ 100 trading 82.24. S&P 500 trading at 3,078. You back things up a bit to find last night's future open. There's your open at about 6 p.m. Sunday, pretty much right where we closed on Friday. But quite a little escalation from about 3,090 down to a low at 2.30 in the morning of 3,077, just about at that level right now. There's crude oil, $56.50, the price of December crude. The gold contract with volatility in both directions actually made it up to a high of 14.67 at about 5.45 a.m. this morning. We've got December gold trading at 14.61 after quite a tough week last week for the, yellow, the precious metal. And the euro US dollar currently trading at 110.39. In terms of what else you have happening out there, a big day for Alibaba, a record setting day. And man, the numbers are staggering $30 billion in sales and climbing. They have their singles day going on in China. That is one of their biggest, if not, I guess, the biggest, you'll call it, with the record. 30 billion. That's three followed by 10 zeros in one day. Pretty remarkable. And to jump over to their chart, I guess all but expected because Alibaba not really reacting too much, actually down to 185.78. Maybe that factoring in with some of the Hong Kong unrest over there. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pezzimento coming up at 9. I'll be back at 10 o'clock live programming all day at TFNN. We'll be right back.